Good morning, I'm Assistant Sheriff Charles Hank, and I'm going to brief you on additional details as we know them today about the officer involved shooting that occurred on Wednesday, March 20, 27, 2019. The suspect is Gregory Joseph Gancy. As all of you are aware, yesterday, March 28th, Gancy was sentenced to five consecutive life sentences without the possibility of parole for the crimes he was being held for at the Clark County Detention Center. The details of the officer involved shooting. On Wednesday, March 27, 2019, Officer Wynn took Clark County Detention Center inmate Gregory Gancy to the Steinberg Diagnostics Center located, excuse me, for a medical procedure. At the completion of the procedure, Gancy was being escorted by Officer Wynn through the parking lot towards Wynn's unmarked patrol vehicle. As Wynn and Gancy were walking, a Chevy crew cab pickup truck stopped in the parking lot with the engine running and the driver's door left open. The driver of the vehicle had stepped out of the truck to retrieve something in the rear of the truck bed. At this time, Gancy, who was in belly chains and leg shackles, saw the unoccupied truck, jumped into the driver's seat, and took off through the parking lot. As the truck sped through the parking lot, Officer Wynn fired three rounds at Gancy, striking the driver's side window and door. Gancy was struck once in the left tricep. Gancy continued driving through the parking lot and then turned northbound on Maryland Parkway. Gancy drove into the left lanes of the northbound Maryland Parkway, passing an LVMPD prisoner transport van, also stopped at the light. Gancy came up behind a black Nissan sedan that was stopped in traffic and slammed into the car. He then put the pickup in reverse and ran the, rammed the Nissan several times, forcing his way through the traffic, damaging four cars. By then, Officer Wynn was in his unmarked patrol car and began pursuing Gancy with lights and sirens. Marked patrol units from the Downtown Area Command, as well as the Northeast Area Command, joined the pursuit until Gancy's vehicle ran out of gas near Main Street in Carson, where he was taken into custody. Arresting officers provided Gancy with emergency medical attention and called for the ambulance. He was taken to UMC trauma and treated for the gunshot wound. Gancy was released from the hospital and rebooked into the Clark County Detention Center. 